Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Maribel MUA and today I just wanted to do a quick tutorial on how to do a winged eyeliner and how I do it easily. Um, don't forget, you know, practice makes perfect, but I hope this video will help you if you struggle with doing a winged eyeliner. Um, also, this is just a quick kind of get ready with me as well for natural day wear makeup. Um, that I wanted to primarily focus on how to do winged eyeliner. So don't forget to comment down below. Let me know what you think and what are your favorite eyeliner products. Also subscribe to my channel and you can follow me on social media at MaribaMUA on Twitter, Snapchat, Instagram, and Facebook. All right, let's get started. All right, so I am going to start by prepping my skin. Today I'm using the Benefit Pore Professional Primer. Um, I'm using this primer today because I'm going to be using a um, foundation stick. So I feel like this primer works a little better with um, that type of formula. And I'm just going to prime in my T-zone. My skin's already been moisturized. And I also have contacts in. These are the Bessio eyes um, in... Uh, like a forest green I think it's called and I love these contacts um, I like the blue ones the best but I don't have any of the blue ones at this moment I usually buy like one pair at a time um, right now I think they're having buy two get two but it's still like a hundred dollars and I just can't justify spending a hundred dollars on contacts right now So I also already have my eyebrows done. I used the Benefit Precisely My Brow today um, just for, you know, day makeup because I'm going to go out and run some errands. Um, so for foundation, I'm using the Makeup Forever HD stick. This is in the color 155R370. Um, I believe the R colors mean it has like a red undertone. And I'm just putting this on my face. I'm gonna put a little on my chin just so I can match everything and on my neck. With the damp beauty blender, I'm gonna go ahead and start blending this out. I really like this foundation. Um, it's really easy to work with and it's buildable. Um, I also just like this for traveling. I think this is like way easier to use when you're traveling versus like bringing um, something in a glass bottle. I always get really scared that my stuff is either A, gonna get lost in the plane or B, shatter. So this stuff kind of makes you feel a little bit better. All right, so I like the foundation. So now I'm, for concealer today, I'm gonna use the Dior, ooh. Dior Skin Star Concealer. And this is in the shade uh, one. This is Ivory. This is probably a little too light, but I feel like Dior doesn't really do that light. Like their light isn't that light. Yeah, this is not that light. And I'm just doing a little bit. I would highlight. And I'm going to take my damp beauty blender and blend this out. To set my under eyes today, I'm using the Kat Von D Locket Brightening Powder in Petal. And I'm going to use my Veramona Cake and Bake Sponge. And I'm gonna blend this out underneath my eye. And then on this um, brush by Spectrum, this is the C07, this is the Rose Gold Collection. I'm gonna take my Charlotte Tilbury Flawless Foundation Powder and I'm gonna just set a little bit on my cheeks here. And for bronzer, I'm taking my Marc Jacobs bronzer in Tantric. I'm going to take the large fan brush. 
I'm gonna warm up my face. Then for blush, I'm using MAC in Peaches. And I'm using this BH Cosmetics brush. Um, this is their quartz, rose gold quartz. Quartz? Yeah, I think it's just the quartz. And I'm just gonna put a little bit on my cheeks here. You guys know I love contouring my nose, so I'm gonna use my Spectrum Angled Brush in A22 with the Benefit Hula Bronzer. I'm gonna do a little nose contouring. And with this brush, C07, and my Beauty Blender sponge, I'm gonna buff this out. For highlighting, I am using the Glow Kit Sweets by Anastasia Beverly Hills. And I'm taking this pinky shade, Sassy Grape. And I'm gonna apply that on the high point to my cheeks. And I'm gonna use the BH Cosmetics brush. Then with this shade Marshmallow, I'm gonna just bring that down my nose. in the corner of my eyes. And I'm gonna take my MAC Fix Plus Spray and I'm just gonna spray my face so all that powder can absorb back into my skin. With my sponge, I'm just gonna press any excess setting spray into my face. And I'm just gonna zoom you guys in, and that way you can see close up how to make winged eyeliner. So for the eyes, I'm gonna take this MAC Paint Pot and Soaked Ochre, and I'm gonna prep my lids. I'm using this brush here um, by Spectrum, B03. I like this because it just works to stipple on any setting material. And this will help cancel out any discoloration on your eye. That's why I like this color with your skin. And I'm just pressing this on. A little bit goes a long way with this powder, or this product, excuse me. It's a, not a powder, this cream. And you can take your beauty blender after and you can just like press that into your skin more. And then I do like to set this. So I'm gonna take whatever powder is left on here and just brush this onto the top lid. And this just gives your eyelids like a smooth base for the eyeliner application. So for the eyeliner, we are using this Sephora Waterproof Stylographic Classic Line. There's a few different ways you can do a wing. I'm gonna show you how I do mine. 
what I like to do is looking down, I have my compact here in my hand and I'm gonna look down into it. And I'm gonna take right here from the corner. I'm just gonna lightly brush up a line. And depending on how big you want your wing, you can make this part shorter or longer. And then you can take this down. And just take that down. So as you can see, it kind of gives like a good outline. Okay. So you see you have this already pretty much done wing. And then you can take your eyeliner pen and drag it over the top of the lid. And you can make this line as thick or thin as you'd like it. And you can go in on your eye as far as you'd like. Now we just want to work on filling in the wing. So if in the instance you want to make your wing just a little sharper, what you can do is you can take a little bit of concealer and just clean up on the side. And you just want to move the direction with the wing. And now we're gonna do the other side. So for the other side, it's the same thing. So now we have them both done. And you just wanna look straight forward and just make sure that they are even. So that is it for both eyes. Um, your winged eyeliner is never gonna be like a mirror image perfect, um, but you can definitely get close and just always, you know, practice. If you wanna get good at anything, you need to do it every day. So if you, um, you know, like have a daytime job, just, um, you know, try and get up earlier in the day to like practice and then wear it to work. And if you fuck up or it doesn't look good, it's just makeup, just wipe it off and keep it moving. So next that you want to do is you can go ahead and curl your eyelashes. I think I did pretty good, I got them really even. I'm gonna use this Too Faced Waterproof Mascara. This is the Better Than Sex. Um, I like waterproof eye products during the summer just cause I feel like my eyes like get sweaty. I don't know how to explain it. I just feel like your makeup transfers more in the summer. So if you use waterproof, it's less likely to budge. And then for eyelashes today, I'm using these lashes. I believe these are Lily lashes. And for the lash glue um, to apply them, I'm using the House of Lashes lash glue in black. Now that we have the false eyelashes on, I am going to take the mascara and just apply it a little bit underneath the eye. I think the hardest part about being on YouTube is everybody sees the face that you make when you put on your mascara. <laughs> it's so awful. I'm gonna prime my lips with the Anastasia Beverly Hills lip primer. Sorry about the background noise. The bathroom is being remodeled. Next with the lip liner, I'm using All Natural Milani Lip Liner. And then I'm using this Dose of Colors lipstick. These are new. Um, I got this at Ulta Online. I love this formula and the packaging is so pretty. So I'm gonna use this color 
This is glaze. This is just a really pretty, like, peachy pink. Just set my makeup today. I'm using the Hangover 3-in-1 um, Too Faced setting spray. Alright you guys, thanks for watching this winged eyeliner tutorial. Um, if you have any questions or comments, don't forget to leave those down below. Also give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And please subscribe to my channel. You can follow me on all social media at Mariba MUA. That's Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and Snapchat. And I hope to see you guys in my next video. Bye.